Hello, this is Glozell. Is you okay? Is you good? Because I want to know. I, is this, you know, uh, am I in the... Okay. I might have done the last, like, three videos without my head in the video. But anyway, um, this is the Glozell Green Channel where I'm just answer, answering questions the best of my ability. Someone please answer these questions, okay? Because if you can't ask anyone else, then ask Glozell. You can ask me, and then... You know, at least it'll be discussed and you can look at what other people write. So write about the question, okay? Not about my answer. Write the, about the question so these people can get uh, another perspective, okay? Because obviously they're seeking help. All right. Here we go. We'll call this Boo. Okay, Boo. I, Glozell, I have a problem and I don't know what to do. My mother has medical problems and I'm scared for her. She said she bleeds excessively amounts during her time of the week. I'm, I'm assuming you meant month. I don't know if you're a girl also. Anyway, okay. And when she went to the doctor two years ago, they found bumps that could be cancerous, but she did nothing about it. She also said she has knots in her breast. She keeps putting it off going to the doctor and getting insurance. I'm scared because she's all I have. I've lost my dad when I was 10 and I'm petrified to lose her. What should I do? Okay. Someone else can answer this question, but now you're 10 and now you've got to be adult in a way, okay? Because she's in denial. I don't know if she's in some kind of sickness with uh, some drugs or any kind of thing but the writing is on the wall okay so what you can do is you need to figure out in the event that she's in the hospital or you know the hospice or something or she dies okay that's the reality that she might die where do you go what do you do do you have a plan in place does she have a plan in place for you okay she might be in denial and might not be able to deal with it okay but they might help you a little, just a little bit, because it's, it's terrible seeing someone uh, deteriorate. However, it is a, I don't know how to say, a wicked gift in a way that you, you know. You know, some people just, boom, I, I didn't know, I, out of the blue sky, now what I'm going to do. Like, you, you have time to prepare, okay, that something might happen significantly you know, if she doesn't, you know, snap out of this and, and get some help or whatever she, you know, going to do. All right. Okay. And that's, that really stinks, you know, but sometimes people handle things how they handle them. All right. And she's not all that you have. Okay. You know, it's going to be a, a great loss, but you might have an uncle, auntie, grandmother, or, or somebody you need to find out who to, who, where would you go? Because you will be, you're only 10. Okay. So hopefully she gets better and you know we just pray right you would just pray right now we just lift up hands right now for all 